Hey everybody, welcome back to Brain Stew. I'm Joe Stone. This week we talked to Jeff Mitchell, an extraordinary sculptor and illustrator in Portland, Oregon. Hi. Ah, Jeff Mitchell. Uh, I'm a Carta Pesto artist. Uh, been doing it for three years. What was it kind of, what kind of artist? Carta, uh, Carta Pesto. Huh. I've never heard of it. If you, if you Google it. It's me. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Which is interesting. I mean, it's pretty heavy in uh, like Italy and stuff, but I haven't. They call it paper mache clay here, but it's not really a mache though. It's it's more. It's it's organic. And here's another cool thing too for live action events. Go ahead, you go ahead and pick up one. There, I guess I'll hold on to it. Yeah, you act like it's that. Oh, yeah, oh, <laughs> you know, it's you know for live action events. You know, even protests, you know, wear a mask like this, it's like a helmet. Go ahead, hit it. And it's this super thin. That is tough. Oh, yeah. I'm not kidding. That's what I say. This material is... Uh, That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. It's, 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 I, love the detail, I love the detail on the inside. Oh, yeah. It's so, it's so easy to do. I mean, you know. Yeah, well, I'll hold it up to the camera here. And, you know, it's a cheap it's a cheap animatronic, so, you know, you just move the tongue and the eyes. Oh, it's it's slick. <laughs> I'm normal, how are you? <laughs> of course, it's just wires from work that you can embed into this stuff and, yeah. oh, middle age. Happens. <laughs> <laughs> how, how'd you, so how'd you get into the, the, doing the mask stuff? But, yeah, it started off as a hobby I couldn't spend any money on. And I started doing research and I found, you know, this paper mache recipe is very rudimentary. Yeah. But I made my first batch and discovered that, you know, it was, an incredible sculpting material done with household supplies. Remember, nature is its own example. Uh, yeah, uh, pay your bills, uh, great job, team. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it for this week. I hope you enjoyed Jeff's story. If you want to learn more about Jeff and his work, you can check out his website, flyingblockstudio.wordpress.com, or you can go to his Facebook page, Flying Block Studios. Um, until next time, uh, well, make sure you follow us, too on YouTube and Instagram and Facebook and Twitter and I think that's it. Anyways, see you next week. Bye.